Hi, I'm Tommy with BuyTwayRadios.com, and this is Radio 101. Buying a GMRS radio is easy. Getting the license to use one is, well, not so much. But you can do it if you know how to navigate the FCC website. This is where and how to apply for a GMRS license. First, register for a username. Go to the FCC Universal License System page at FCC.gov, and under the Filing subheading, click New User Registration. This will take you to the FCC Registration Login page. Select the option Register under the column header Need a Username. This will take you to the online FRN registration form. Enter your email address in the field and click Check Availability. This will be your username. Next, register for an FRN number. Before you apply for any FCC license, you will need an FCC registration number, known as an FRN. Once you have an FRN, it's your number for life. To apply for an FRN, go to the FCC Universal License System, or ULS page. Go to the Filing subheading and click New User Registration. Under the Username Login section, log in with your username and password. This will take you to the user homepage. If you already have an FRN, skip to step 3. If not, register a new FRN. There are two registration types, business and individual. Choose an individual. Your contact address should be within the United States or its territories, so this is the option to choose. Click Continue. This takes you to a second box with another set of radio buttons. Choose an individual and click Continue. This will take you to the actual online FRN registration form. Fill out the entire form with your name and address. After the form is submitted and accepted, you should be taken to a page with your FRN registration information, along with your assigned FRN number. Write this number down and keep it in a safe place. If you already have existing FRNs, you must associate them with your username before you can manage them. To do this, go back to the user homepage, click on Associate Username to FRN, and fill out the form. Next, apply for the license. Go to the FCC Universal License System, or ULS page, and under the Filing subheading, click File Online. This should take you to the License Manager login page. Enter your new FRN number and password to log in. This should take you to the My Licenses page. Click the link on the left sidebar labeled Apply for a New License. This will take you to another page with a drop-down menu to select the service license for which you want to apply. You will want to choose the option ZA, General Mobile Radio, or GMRS. Click the Continue button, choose No for all three drop-downs on the next page, click Continue again, and you will be taken to another form. Fill out that one, submit it, and it should take you to the page Manage Existing FRNs. Now you have to pay the license fee. On the Manage Existing FRNs page, click on FRN Financial. This will take you to the page where you begin the fee payment process. It should list your FRN number on the left and the link view or Make Payments to the right. Click the link to go to another page with the FRN listed under the tab Awaiting Payment Confirmation and a Make Payment link to the right. Click that link, fill out the payment form, and submit. And you're done. The FCC should issue your GMRS call sign within a few days. To check the status of your license and call sign, simply log into the ULS License Manager. And there you have it. That's how to register for a GMRS license from the FCC. If you have any questions or want to know more about GMRS licenses, Please don't hesitate to give us a call, email, or hit us up in our online chat at buy2aradios.com. I'm Tommy with buy2aradios.com, and this is Radio 101. Class dismissed.